Hey guys, it's Chris Stafford with Staff Athletics. Hope you guys are all staying safe and healthy. Uh, just wanted to send out a short update regarding our flag football league. Uh, we will offer flag football again this fall. Uh, we have made some major changes though. Uh, we wanna make sure that we err on the side of the safety and health of our, of our players and their families. So we pushed the start date back uh, so we can learn more about the coronavirus and just make sure that we're doing things in a way that everybody is comfortable with. Uh, we also wanna make sure that we're accommodating multi-sport athletes as most of our participants are. Uh, so we will start our flag football season at the end of October. So all softball players and football players can participate at the conclusion of their fall season. Uh, and we're gonna do multiple games a weekend instead of single game weekends. Um, playing two to three games a weekend for three consecutive weeks will allow us to end our flag football season in early November. So it's gonna be a lot of flag football and a lot of fun in a very short uh, amount of time. Um, so that allows winter sport athletes to play as well uh, because our last flag football game will end before uh, swimmers, wrestlers, and basketball players uh, will start their season. So hopefully that real short format at the end of October and early November will allow everyone to be able to play that wants to play. Uh, we'd love to have, have you guys all follow us on social media and check out our website at staffathletics.com so you can stay um, in the loop as far as updates and, and look into further details. So coaches, go ahead and start putting your teams together. Go ahead and register. We're open for registration as of today. Uh, when you register, head coaches, we will send you a code that you can share with the rest of the members of your team. So when they register using that same code, um, they will be properly placed on your roster. So it's a very simple process. Uh, we do have a simple confidential need-based financial aid process as well. So if you have a player or two on your team that needs some financial assistance, we definitely want to make sure that we can accommodate them and make sure that money is never a reason uh, that a young athlete can't play. The last major change I want to share with you is girls flag football is blowing up across the country and the Georgia High School Association is going to add girls flag football uh, in high schools across the state of Georgia for this upcoming school year. And we want to make sure uh, that we're a part of that process and a part of making sure that young female athletes have the opportunity to get off to a head start in a great sport uh, that's up and coming in the state of Georgia and really across the country. So we will be offering girls divisions and boys divisions from second grade through middle school. So coaches, go ahead and start putting your teams together. Please reach out to me, Chris Stafford, at chris.stafford at staffathletics.com if you have any questions. Most of those questions can be answered um, on our social media and our website. Uh, but again, feel free to reach out anytime and stay safe. Look forward to hearing from you and God bless. Thank you.